just want to give you this quick warning. Warning, Will Robinson, danger, danger, about this Xeno Pro update that I just put on for the flight control version 1.0.13. And the warning is don't use anything but Windows 10 because I kept trying to do it in my Windows 7 because I hate Windows 10. I can't stand Windows 10. And I never use it. But what happens in with the new version of the update tool, it just keeps crashing with the Windows uh, 7. Even if you run it as administrator or whatever, it'll get through the... You know, the update will be going on there, and then it'll just keep crashing. And no, you know, when I got the Xeno Pro, you see this part in the in the app about doing the firmware updates. No, they didn't fix that. The only thing I think you can update through the app is the controller firmware. All the other stuff is that same crap where you got to put that update tool on there, and you have to, you know, do the one file with the battery off, which would be the flight control. You take the battery out, plug the USB in, do that. And then to do the other one, you have to plug the battery in and turn it on. And then to do the camera, you have to put it on the micro SD card and do it through there. You know, it's the same big pain in the butt. You know, they didn't, there's nothing pro about it, okay? It's Xeno not pro is what this thing is, okay? I wish I'd have never bought it, trust me. Big waste of money. Anyway, so, yeah, you can do the update, but just be careful using Windows 7 because I could never get it to work. It kept crashing, and we have problems with it. You can go ask Chris. All right, guys, have a nice day.